My name is Ilan Hall and we're here in my restaurant in downtown Los Angeles, The Gorbals. Our food is uh, inspired by my family heritage. My father's from Glasgow, Scotland. My mother's from Jerusalem. And it's just food that I've grown up with, things that I find tasty mixed together and just whatever comes out of my, my mixed up little head. From a very young age, I've combined pork with lots of traditional Jewish foods. And I honestly think that that's the only thing that's missing in old school Jewish cuisine. I'm gonna be making Welsh rarebit with a fried egg on top of it. You take bread, grill it, put a sauce on top of it that's a combination of beer and some sort of cheese with different spices. Um, in this one we've done Worcestershire sauce, Dijon mustard, cayenne pepper, smoked cheddar, and, uh, and porter, porter beer, our anchor porter. It's sort of it's, it's like making a bechamel or a sauce mornay, which is a bechamel thickened with cheese, except instead of using milk, we use beer. This is um, pumpernickel bread with coriander from a, a Russian bakery in Hollywood. It's been partially grilled because it's going back in the oven, so we don't want to dry it out too much. It's going to take about six minutes to get nice and bubbly and brown. And in the meantime, we're going to be frying an egg that goes on top of it. So, just a plain old chicken egg. So we're gonna get oil ready. I always like starting um, eggs because I don't like any color on them uh, in a cold pan. Get the oil all around. A little bit of salt. And I like doing this over here on a very, very, very medium heat flat top so that it cooks very, very gently. See, I like cooking until it's nice and bubbly. It's got a little bit of color on it bubbling on the sides, the bread underneath is toasted, it's not too overdone. And before the egg goes on, we cover it with a little bit of Worcestershire sauce. We take our egg, gently place it on top of it. Finish with a little more Worcestershire on top. And cracked pepper, and there you are. Welsh rare but with fried egg. The theme of our restaurant is that everything is a very good value for money. We don't have a very expensive wine list. Our spirits menu is very concise and not you know, we don't have 40 different liquors. And we're just trying to keep things simple, clean, and focused so that, you know, people can enjoy their time and not have a, an overbearing restaurant experience.